he's poor. Look at this place. He must have enough money if he offered it over the phone like that, without even knowing what our charity did. Or he could be a sex maniac. Wishful thinking. Hi! Are you the charity people? Yes, this is Miss Truman, and I am Mr. Wanderby. Well, please come in. Please, sit down. I've got some good homemade wine if you like. That'll be just fine. Don't you think, Miss Truman? Yes, that'll be... swell. I just got back from the zoo. Really? I take a walk over to the zoo every day. My wife usually goes with me, but she's in California visiting my sister. That's why this place is such a mess. When she's home, she makes me put all that away. I'm a retired electrician, you know? No, I... How long has she been gone? She's been gone for about a month now. While I was waiting for you, I was practicing how to memorize 10 items. Do you know the secret of how to memorize 10 items? I'm afraid I don't understand you, Mr. Pignotti. You just mentioned 10 items, and I'll memorize them right off the bat. You give me one, Miss Truman, and then you give me one, Mr. Wandermeyer. Just give me an object. Just say any object. Go on. Girl. Couch. Boy. I. Chair. Dog. Bird. Stop sign. Lighthouse. Cockroach. Here's the order you told me in. Girl, couch, boy, I, chair, dog, bird, stop sign, lighthouse, cockroach. You got them all right, Mr. Pignotti. You just make a mental picture. Like when Miss Truman said girl, I made a mental picture. And then when you said couch, all I had to do was make a mental picture of a couch and attach it to the grid. See, you've got to attach the pictures in your mind. That's the secret to remembering them all. Go ahead, you try it, Mr. Mr. Wandermeyer.